someone didn't sleep last night. Still, you never texted me back. I figured you were mad at me. Who says I'm not? We got bigger drama than mine. It's on. For the first time in our school storied history, our cheerleading squad! <laughs> Proving that Sun Grove Eagles do know how to fly. Listen, you guys, the stories I could tell from the front, all right? The tales of victory, of carnage. These young women killed the competition. These young women are bloodthirsty, and they... Should have been wearing your hands, huh? What? Your Hamsa bracelet? The one I gave you? That if you'd been wearing it, you wouldn't have fainted. I fainted? They tried to call your mom, but no luck. Probably out on official police business. You know, violating rights, forcing confessions. It's a good thing your BFF was here to come and look after you. Come to think of it? I haven't seen you wear your Hamsa in a Good long while. I wonder where it ran off to. I think it's at home. Mm -hmm. And I don't need protecting. I just forgot to eat. Well, lucky for you, I saved you some celebratory cake. You girls and your bodies, all you do is abuse yourself. I abuse myself at least once a day. This one, her body's a holy temple. She could probably do with a bit more abuse. Relieve some of that stress. She looks aggrieved, doesn't she? Your heart's racing. I'm gonna try mom again. No, don't do that. I'm fine. You don't look fine. I'm going to get you some juice. I bet some cake would help. Seriously, you should actually eat some. You look like death warmed over. So, Splitsville, right? I knew it was gonna implode. What? Will and Coach. Sefini. Swan song, curtains, Sayonara baby. He's not at his recruiter's table, and she's not here on the biggest day of her pathetic career. Something big must have gone down. Yeah, he's probably just at another school. Um, maybe she's sick. Love sick. I had another dream. Like the pyramid. Except it was just us. And it was raining, like that night. Remember? Come on, you must remember that night. Yes, I remember. We were at Lanvers, and we were doing toe touch jumps at the edge of one of the overlooks. And then we heard this noise, like something falling a long way down. So we went to the edge to have a look, but it was dark. It was so dark that we couldn't see the bottom. There was no bottom, and it was scary, all echoey black. This endless abyss. 
like it was calling out to us. Addy, he said that it was calling out. And then I started to slip. So you grabbed my wrist to try and pull me up, but it hurt. On my wrist, it was bleeding. And then you did it. Did what? You let go. Just like always. You had my wrist and then you didn't anymore. You let go. Why am I always doing bad things in your dreams? Guilty conscience? Shoes, Addy. Where are your cheer shoes? I forgot them, I guess. You know the rules. Fifty push ups. Was over, I remembered how bright it was, how it shines everywhere, even the places you don't want it to go, into the cracks and corners and weak places, how after a little while it makes you miss the dark. I